it is 601 right now and happening today. The sentencing portion of the trial of David Ware continues. Ware was convicted on five counts in the death of Tulsa Police Sergeant Craig Johnson and shooting of Officer Ress Sarkishan. And on Monday, the jury handed down recommended sentences on the non-capital offenses they convicted him on last week. To News Oklahoma reporter Caitlin Revis joining us now with a timeline of the sentencing. And Caitlin, what's next for Ware? Corey, what's next is where could be sentenced to life in prison with or without the possibility of parole or the death penalty. Today, the state will cross-examine the defense witness, a licensed psychologist and addiction expert. Then jurors will hear victim impact statements from Johnson's family. In Monday sentencing for Ware's non-capital offenses, the jury agreed to life in prison for shooting with intent to kill, 30 years for possessing a firearm after a felony, 25 years for possession of a drug with intent to distribute, and one year for obstructing an officer as well as $20,000 in fines. Now the defense called those sentencing recommendations a win. Once the sentence was handed down, a veteran attorney Kevin Adams says he thinks the jury will show his client mercy. We're pleased with the uh, with the verdicts and we think it indicates this jury is going to show Mr. Ware some grace. We're going to show him some mercy. Tulsa County District Attorney Steve Kunzweiler says today will be tough because the jury will be hearing from family and friends. Mrs. Johnson and, uh, and their son uh, have prepared victim impact statements and uh, we fully expect that they're going to be testifying tomorrow. They were on our witness list and so uh, this jury is going to hear from them. Again, on the first degree murder conviction, where could be sentenced to life in prison with or without the possibility of parole or the death penalty. In the next 30 minutes, we'll hear from both attorneys on the next steps for where. Live in studio, Caitlin Revis, 2 News, Oklahoma.